right hello everyone this is victor momo from excel moments in this video i'm going to show you how to create a hyperlink from excel to a word document not just to a word document but to a section in a word document not just to a section say to a bookmark in word all right let's get into it so in here this is a folder that has you know the workbook you are looking at that's hyperlinks to word i'm going to create a word document in here so i'm going to do new and i'm going to do word document I'm just going to call this maybe hyperlink test open that up i'm going to create some random text here it goes to rand the number of paragraphs maybe i say 30 paragraphs and 10 sentences per paragraph i press enter never knew that rand could work in word right okay now you see that happen did i do a lot 30 and 10 hmm. okay it's done all right so i'm just going to create for example a bookmark to how many pages do I have here? I should have that's nine pages, right? Okay, so I'm just going to create maybe a bookmark to this last paragraph. I think a triple click should select the whole paragraph. Good, and I do insert and I do bookmark. Okay, and I call this maybe test one, right? So I do add, so then I scroll up somewhere, maybe you know, like somewhere in some other page maybe four thereabouts okay so i do the same thing i kind of triple click right so i then do a bookmark and i call this test two right okay so i do add i go to the top of the document i save and i close all right so i come back into um excel so let's just say i put the names here test one and test two okay right so i now create the hyperlink so very simple i use the hyperlink function right the link location because it's an external link now i don't need the hash all i need is you know the path to the document but because this document is in the same folder as the excel workbook you don't need the path you can just use the name so i'm going to call this i just did that to simplify things hyperlink test dot docx okay and then what you need to do is you just need to concatenate it using a hash to the name of the bookmark so this is supposed to read hash test one okay but i wouldn't want to you know um, type in the name there i would want it to be dynamic by linking to the cell that has the name of the bookmark so i'll put the hash first and then i would concatenate using an and you know to test one okay so that's the name of the word document with the hash and the bookmark and then put a comma the friendly name is what you want to see so here maybe i just see the name of the bookmark. Maybe that's what I just okay all right, and I copy this here. All right, so let's open test one now. Test one should take us to like the last paragraph in there. Okay, you can see, and that's page nine. Good. And if I were to click the other one, test two, that should take us to around page four. Okay, and you can see that takes us to page four. Okay, so if you had a document that was like 200, 300 pages and you had the bookmark right here, with a hyperlink, you could go to the specific, you know, section that you want rather than well, maybe opening it, typing the page number, you know, just something funky, I thought, to share. So if you like this video, please hit the like button. You can also subscribe to the channel, Excel Moments. For now, I'm out.